Hello there everyone and thank you for joining me here this start of a new campaign in Old World Blues, the A to Z series in which we're now playing as the Dry Blowers. We blow dry. I'm not sure how else to say, but we blow dry, oh god, a tribal nation. But we're going to go to war with the Mold Bones because they need to be blown real dry. And they have only like two divisions, so we should be okay going in. Um, probably just get Dinosaur Caverns and just kind of take them out that way. Make it super easy for us, hopefully. Honestly, just keep these guys in place. That's all that really matters as we're just walking through their lands. Of course, we're using Old World Blues. Old World Blues Radio. Old World Blues Tech Expanded. Fast Justifications. Uh, Old World Blues Bitches Formable. Uh, what else are we using? Ah, also, we're using reworked and generic focus trees as well to see what we can you know, cook up here. So, go to that. Go right there. Go right there. And we got them! Already, not even the first minute's over yet. And we got them. But yeah, that's what we're going to be focusing on. Now we're going to be going to go to war with Ouroboros next because that, they are our main rival here for this campaign. Uh, with some pacification, that'll be good. It gives as much compliance as possible. Uh, let's set them up here against Ouroboros. Set this up here. Let time go on just a little bit. There we go. And we have a natural spirits. Outcasts. Oh, no. A little more stability, a little more appeal to refugees, which means nothing. Current objective survive, which is always good. And like normal, I'm going to go and grab... Oh, Compliance Growth Speed would actually be really good. Um, daily political power. Yeah, I'm going to grab extra political power. So if you want to about John Caveman Lynch, please go ahead. But really, our main goal is to take out Ouroboros. And then kind of go from there. Also, since we're here, I don't know if uh, we, we have this yet. We need definitely a little more stability. Definitely more war support. Uh, we could tributize people if we really wanted to, which they're all going to reject us anyways, I know for a fact. Um, it looks like we don't have uh, anyone... We can't really... Oh. Uh, unite into Colorado, which kind of sucks, but that's all right. Oh, hello. And they're immediately going to go to war with us, too. All right, well, uh, we're going to prove the countryside here. How many divisions do they got? This is going to be very messy. Two to nine. That's not ideal. And we have only four. We are trying to make two more divisions, so let's save just in case. Um, honestly, it's probably good to just auto-deploy our divisions, because if we can, we'll try to encircle some divisions, destroy enemy divisions. But if things go really badly... Well, that's what the cons command is for. So we've got two divisions down there we've got to take care of. There's at least one right here. Uh, oh, they're almost ready to come out anyways. How much more? Oh, they're out. Nice. We didn't have to deploy them early. Which is really good. There you go. Should have done that. Anyway, so you have one, two, three, four. At least four divisions, if not more. Um, so how long is it going to take for them? Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Not ideal. Um, reference manuals are good, though. We should probably start focusing on a land auction, so we are going to go with tried and true conventional warfare because we're just using normal uh, infantry. Oh boy. Yeah, that's a lot of divisions. Hmm. I prefer you if you were down here. You can do this and circle those guys. Uh, we'll see. Uh, these guys are only 10 combo width, which is very similar to them as well, which is not great, not bad. Or just do that anyways. Get a Moab and circle destroy if you possibly can. That's our main goal. <clears throat> oh, they're they're pooping a, a lot of divisions, aren't they? Well, why don't we just do that? <clears throat> they found us. Not good. Not good. If everyone else can hold out, that'd be fantastic. If we could promote this guy, well, I'll be honest, that would also be very fantastic. But it looks like this is going to be a little difficult for us, if not. Um, rationalism. Of course, we're using uh, the tech expanded, so we're gonna grab some democracy, and grab some uh, secret languages. How are we losing so badly for these guys? They're probably really thick, but still. Let's see. They caught us. Get over there if you can. You know what? You hold. You just go right there. What the heck? Alright, so Ouroboros has way too many divisions to start, and there's nothing we can really do about them, because we had to take out Old Bones anyway, so I'm going to redo this just a little bit, because we don't just don't have enough divisions for this entire war. And that was the end of our Ouroboros. Totally didn't use Khan's commands for the dry blowers. Every time I come back, I'm just thinking, we're blowing really dry, but we do have some special forces here. They're not great. They're 10 combat width. But I think we're going to change it up right now, as we are trying to expand our tech, our lands, everything else about us, and we just got a lot more army XP because of the focus we just did. Um, I'll be honest with this one, we're using with the generic focus tree 
uh, submod for overall blues. I went with defensive posture just because I never choose this route, and we're going to choose a uh, focus tree route that doesn't make any sense for us because we're trying to expand our lands. So we're going to be very, very defensive. Um, so there's this one because I never choose this one, and I want to do something at least a little bit different this time um, than what I normally do, which even though a lot of this is still very similar to what I always do anyway. So uh, starting compliance, starting compliance, sure, why not? We'll choose that one because we can, and we'll grab this one over here because special forces are, well, special. In the meantime, we have no scrap, which sucks, but we have core pretty, mu pretty much everything down here except for this one, and now we have. Look at all those factories. Oh my god, no wonder Uroboros is so freaking strong. Um, so we're doing pretty well on everything else here. We just need more guns. But in the meantime, as you can see, we have one, two, three divisions trapped, which is fantastic. I'll let you guys do that real quick. Now we'll do this a little slowly at a time. No template for anti-tank rifles. Well, I think that's a giant mistake. We only have 43, so give it a little bit more time before we do too much else here. Try to make up more civvies, of course. We already on well equipped army. We're on raider bands. We have more than enough manpower now, which is fan flip fantastic. Um, very good, very good, very very good. Uh, can you go here? Oh, good. See you guys this way, and then see you guys this way. That should be ideal. So their guys are attacking us actually now too. They have demo teams, which we actually started with demo teams, which is very very nice. Um, that's risky, but do that anyways. There you go. For the special forces, I would like to eventually throw on some more stuff such as demo teams for themselves as well. Good, 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 good. We're losing here, which makes sense. And now we're not going to be losing here, which is very good. Um, 73, they're attacking, they're panicking. We have lost quite a few guys already. Almost an equal amount to them. Which is kind of disappointing, truth be told. So, help them out. We're entrenching our positions. We'll be fortifying the ruins for even more entrenchment. So, we're really all about that entrenchment right now. One and a half political power every single day. We got some psychiatry, which is good. Uh, terrain penalty reduction doesn't really matter too much. We're going to go this way to eventually start working on some air reduction, which would be very nice. Those souls join. Why are we taking so long to destroy these guys? We are way stronger than them. Odd. Oh, because it's on core territory. Because these guys, the Highland Watch, is actually kind of unique in that uh, they have quite a bit of defense, against, at least against Far Sun. Um, and a little more defense on core territory. Attack and defense at the very least. So, let me see you guys over here real quick. So our guys really aren't the strongest against these guys, which kind of really sucks. But uh, that's why I want to focus a little bit more on planes eventually. We do have a navy as well, which is only one ship right now, but whatever. That's fine. That's all we really need. Help them out. Destroy their organization. That'd be fantastic. Destroy, destroy, destroy. They're making even more special forces. Very good. And we're just stockpiling a lot of political power for now. Is very good. We have five research slots. That's not the love. Good. So we got rid of those guys. Um, go right here. I would like to do a generic attack, but it looks like they're either missing manpower or equipment. Oh, they got plenty of manpower. Oh my god. They are out of infantry equipment, which is very good to see for us. Egalitarianism. Um, they look through the power. Still all very good focus. So, if we could, I'd like to go here to here. So we'd probably need a spark a little fight here. Of course, we are lacking some ourselves. We're going to grab some more spark because we have none right now. Not ideal. Just smash the living crap out of them if you can. So we're out of guns and we're out of infantry equipment. Well, guns and infantry equipment. Which sucks. But you three go right there. Because you guys can help support the attack right there. And you're going to hang out right there and keep it right there. Let's go up this direction first. Where to find the ruins. Nice. Spark warriors are also very good. And what are we going to do next? Can't grab that quite yet. We'll focus on this. Yes, please. Get right there, which means they'll want to attack us too. When we land right there, I'd love to do a general attack, but that would be suicide. And we're not here to do suicide. Oh, we need mobile fortifications for the next one, huh? Oh, well, you know what? We could use some resources. It gets us only two scrap, but it's alright. Prioritize living standards. Go ahead and do that one. That's fine. I'm just going to do this too. Uh, that's a lot of territory to cover. One, two, three, four. One, three, four. Old Jeffrey. And even if we did that, it wouldn't be very beneficial. So let's just go for the capital, maybe. And for steel to at least try to encircle them, because it's going to get very long and windy around here. So we can make the encirclement. We will, and we have. 
is fantastic. And we're there, yes. Please. More resources are always good. Now, do we want foundries, purification stations, research blueprints, and some more of each of us? And we lose a lot of political power, manpower, or just get more resources. I think just getting more resources, raw resources, is probably for the best. But we're gonna go grab this one next for more go uh, not, uh, more workshop. Yeah, workshops. Um, my apologies about that, but let's continue going on through here. Get more construction speed. At this point, we could probably just do a general attack. And now, since we destroyed all those extra divisions. We could probably just get the capital, and we're going to focus on getting all the VPs. So, that is the goal and plan for now. We've lost almost a 1,000. They've lost almost 2,000, and we definitely have more divisions than they do. I just hope our guys can uh, just hang out and hold out for as long as they need to, before we go any crazier. Or get any crazier, really. There we go. Even though they're not winning, it's fine. Ooh, there goes those guys. Another division, good. Go, go, go. You're literally just here to attack and distract. Hey, portable radios are nice. Grab some of that. We do need to have some planes we could use. Oh my god, you guys are moving so slow. But it's good for our MXP. We're here, brute. More breakthrough, less damage garrisons. You know what? We've already buffed this enough, so. Ooh, that's more breakthrough and attack, but I don't want this defense or HP. Because HP is literally how many hit points you have. That's literally what it is, hit points, and I don't want to lose any more hit points. Centralization's good. Um, resistance growth speed, that'd be nice. Badam Bokal Ruse. You should be able to move pretty quickly through those lands. We need some serious amount of radio, so. Oh, they are spreading up too bad, dang it. Not ideal. Some circuitry is good, though. A little more coordination, yeah. And now they're separating their own lines. Oh boy. Keep it up. They're out of guns. We're out of guns. No one has guns to speak of, so. Once these guys are done, they're completely surrounded. Good. Hey, we love drugs here. <sighs> Get in here so they, don't. so they can't save that division. Are right, some gunsmiths. Uh, what else do we want? Make it cheaper to produce guns. That's good. Oh, hello. It's not ideal. We got encircled ourselves. The AI is not com well. I was gonna say not completely stupid, but you know what? They still have their moments. New Vegas is a downfall. Good for them. Here, squeeze them out. They're not that strong. New Farson. Lost two thousand ourselves. Two thousand for them. Not bad overall. Special forces are gonna die. Don't just don't let any of them move. Just go in. It's fine. It's fine. So I threw on chemical companies for these guys too. Oh yeah. Free civvies. Basically free civvies. Nice. Good stuff. And go. More division. What the heck are you doing? Get a new parson. There we go, there we go. Plenty of manpower for all this stuff. Help them out. There we go. We got them. It took us quite a bit, but we're now in Wyoming. Now, the goal is to get up here so we can get a trade note up to the Baron's Eye. So, I think I'll save that for the next episode. But if you enjoyed this video, please consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow when we try to go Baron's Eyrie and the Black Canyon. Thanks for watching. Have a tremendous rest of your day.